But despite this overwhelming vote in the General Assembly, the bond issue could well fail unless our people have all of the facts. For myself, I am convinced that if we fail to provide these buildings, we fail not only our young people, we fail not only our mentally ill, but we fail Virginia too. It is clear to me, and I hope to you, that we cannot meet the needs of Virginia without the $81 million in bond money to bridge the gap. But between now and November, we must make this clear to everybody. If they understand that this is a Virginia issue, not to be confused with action or philosophy across the Potomac, I'm certain that their own good judgment will prevail. And I appeal to you now to accept fully the responsibility of directing that change 